the master of mimicry whose impressions have earned him the title of one of Britain's top comedians. Yeah, very few politicians have escaped Rory Bremner's comedic wrath, or is it wrath, really? Rory, it's Love, not really. Is wrath it? or wrath, I don't know. You pronounce <laughs> it anyhow you want. OK. So, uh, we just, he's here now, anyway. We were just chatting, actually, that uh, you have some... I'd imagine you have some gifts of politicians at the moment, because there's yeah. some very strong characters with very quirky mannerisms. Uh, and oh, you, I mean, we start with Boris. I mean, you, he, uh, the, the unlikely love child of Angela Merkel and Donald Trump, ladies and <laughs> gentlemen. Yeah, yes, I mean, well, I know Nigel Farage, obviously. And it's interesting the rhythm they have, because his is like my ways. And now, the end is near, it's our face, the final curtain. <laughs> <laughs> but, but it's George Galloway. George Galloway is like tainted love, isn't he? There are times I want to get away. I want to <laughs> run away. Um, so, yeah, and having had a bland time in the coalition, now we've got with this Farage and there's Trump and there's uh, Boris, as we've mentioned, and uh, there's still a bit of David Cameron. I, I don't accept that he's gone. I think it was exciting, God, you know, the referendum. It, I mean, it wasn't the result I wanted. As somebody said, you know, we were, we were knocked out of Europe twice in one week, once by Iceland and once by the people who shop there. But look, <laughs> I, I think it's exciting. So it's an exciting time, and so it's, it's good to be back on the road again. It's brilliant. But on the other hand, good characters. It also feels like the jokes are coming true in a way oh, yes. in these little rooms. I mean, you may have seen the front page of The Sun today. Yeah. 16 years ago, The Simpsons did an episode where Donald Trump became president. Much hilarity ensued. Well, yeah. And now here he is. Well, that's the thing. I mean, in 1973, Tom Lehrer, who's a famous American satirist, he said satire died the day that Henry Kissinger was given the Nobel Peace Prize. Mm. And we're so far beyond that. We've had Tony Blair as Middle East Peace Envoy. He stopped it this year. Well, here, come. Mission, mission accomplished. <laughs> yeah, Middle East has never been more peaceful. Yeah. Um, and <laughs> we've got Boris and we got Donald Trump. And uh, it's so how do you make these people funny? But it's actually, we didn't. The danger is if we make them too funny, like mm. Boris and Donald Trump, you give them a space to work in. People go, oh, it's just Donald Trump. Oh, it's Boris. And they can get away with it. And they lot. become forgivable because, oh, they're Absolutely. just. Absolutely. And a this is the big danger. Right. I think, as Barack Obama said, he said, you know, the trouble is, you know, it's, it's interesting how. Uh, extremism becomes normal and you, you kind of normalize Trump's mm. behavior which is outrageous so we have we've got this material and mm. we've got uh, but Obama was we, American presidents over the years because Obama he always sounds speaks very slowly and with great authority and occasionally sounds like Kermit the Frog <laughs> <laughs> halfway down the stair uh, and we've seen Bill, <laughs> Bill Clinton has come back and that's great I feel sad for Bill because this means Hillary is coming home for four years. <laughs> <laughs> I got used to the idea of her being away. When she was Secretary of State, she was away. <laughs> she did not come home for four years. I had the best four years of my entire life. <laughs> Let me tell you, he's looking like a ghost now. Isn't he, he is, he is. Yeah. Rory, it's lovely to see you. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Where can people hear more of you, see hear more, more of you? Well, we're doing a tour. It's called Partly Political. It's work in progress. And it uh, starts in Bromsgrove tonight, but we're in Gloucester, I think, uh, next week, the Guildhall in Gloucester, and all around the place, the arts centres. So, uh, Fantastic. Yes, so intimate venues that people can really enjoy. We'll put all the details on our website. Make sure you give them to us so we can make sure. I will indeed, yes. It's Bromsgrove, Chelsea. Them, all these sort of places. Brilliant. God, One more thing. Great. Could you throw to Laura as Donald Trump doing the weather? Here's Laura with the weather. She's hot.